Well, well, well. We're back. Back in the same spot. We always seem to get ourselves in. Yes. We. Because you were there. I put this in my head. Yeah, you were. You were. And every time, I have high hopes of this hair being the hair. Being the one. It always disappoints me. Oh yeah, it starts off great. Like all the other hairstyles. One after one, they dry out. They become brittle. Then we're back here. Square one. <laughs> <laughs> this hair failed. Like my previous hair video. Oh, you didn't watch it. Shameless plug. I know. It's just a plug. Right? Whoa! This hair failed. Just like all the other hairstyles. Look at it! Y'all see the ends. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Y'all said it was gonna last. Y'all were right there with me. Don't act like you were. Because you were. You were. I thought this was the hairstyle. But it wasn't. And I'm saying to myself, do I take a chance at buying another dry, dry, and I mean dry, tumbleweed dry. Do I take a chance at buying more dry hair? Go on, honey. Take a chance. Shut up. The answer is no, I tell you. <laughs> no. Nope. I'm going to take this hair out. Oh, yes. I'm going to cut this hair out. And when I come back, you shall see what kind of hair I will have. Or you could just see it in the thumbnail because I'm pretty sure the thumbnail has the new hair. Yeah, I didn't think this whole thing through. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm back. I know, looking a hot, crazy mess right now. <laughs> Don't ask. Before I get started on explaining my corn rolls and why they look the way they look, I forgot, okay? I forgot to um, talk about the hair. Like, the hair I just took out my head. I was so ready to take the hair out my head, I didn't even <laughs> give a, like, a little month review on it. I, um, the hair was good. It was just dry, very dry. Um, it, it still looked almost, almost exactly the same as it did when I first installed it about a month and some change ago. I don't know how long it was exactly. Um, my cornrows were still in mint condition for the most part, but it was just dry. And part of the reason why it was dry because I didn't have any more conditioning grease that, um, Dax linoleum grease I always use for my um, crochet. I kind of ran out and the hair stores were closed at the time. So I was like, ugh. Um, I could have kept the hair in a lot longer. If I would have recrinkled the ends, it would have just looked brand new. It still looked brand new, but uh, I was just done with the hairstyle. I keep picking these dry, dry hairstyles and it just feels like tumbleweed. My real hair was dry. I'm just, ugh. But the hair overall was excellent. I have no complaints besides it being dry at the ends. The hair lasted, it could last it all, maybe two solid months. I mean, it all depends on how well you take care of it. I really didn't take good care of it. <laughs> so, as you can see in the title and the thumbnail, my intro, obviously I didn't think that whole thing. Well, as you can see in the title and the thumbnail, I am doing bomb twists slash passion twist. I'm not sure. It says bomb twist on it. But then when I type in bomb twist, it gives me passion twist. I don't know. But anyway, I got it from Outre Expressions. This is... That's, anyway, no. This is Expressions by Outre. Um, I got this at my local beauty supply store. This is only $6.99. I brought seven packs of these just, just in case. And I like my hair full. These are pre-twisted bob twists. Yes. I wanted to give myself a little break and buy pre-twisted. Okay, these are pre-twisted bomb. See? 
passion twist style bomb like look look what look what it says all right it says wavy bomb twist passion twist style lightweight bomb twist which is it expressions which is it like i'm confused i got it in the length of i think this is 12 inches let me just make sure yeah 12 inches in the color 950 that's basically black with small hints of red um i really wanted to get something with a color at the end like an ombre but they didn't have black with red at the bottom or red with red they didn't really have that at my store they had the 1b27 the hair i just took out that color but i don't i'm getting tired of that color where it's so much um yeah and besides i don't like how it looks it looks sandy it's like mixed through i just want black with one beats with the 27 at the ends i don't want it mixed through why can't they just do that gosh so i got 950 um i got it in 12 inch they had uh, longer inches 14 18 i don't i'm not one to like all that hair i just never did so let me take it out the pack and show you guys what it looks like okay this is it so it's twisted up and this is can you move? Let me just. This is what it looks like. It's nice and springy. It's very light. It's you can't see too much of the red. That's the only thing I'm disappointed in. I was hoping for a little bit. I wish they had 99J, which has more red in it and a little black. But this one is more black with a little red. Yeah, I don't know. I always have wars with this 99J color. I'm trying to get this, but that's another story. So my corn rolls are the way they are right now because i originally planned to take one pack and not individually braid it i didn't really want to i wanted to corn roll with this with this hair i wanted them to be corn rolls with this hair uh these are hard to unravel mostly because they're machine um, wrapped these are ridiculous i mean it takes me uh, quite a few minutes to take out one and i started doing it and i should have took a picture of it i started doing it and it just wasn't looking right wasn't coming out right it was taking too long just to unravel it so that's why <laughs> my, i have a bridge here or else i would have just corn rolled my hair straight back but i wasn't planning on doing like doing it like that i already corn rolled this and i was just gonna corn roll my hair with this hair so i don't know it just didn't work out for me and let me show you my cornrows this is how the front looks don't don't mind it show you the back my hair is still short okay it takes forever to grow back there because my hair is super dry i just did cornrows straight back because that last cornrow pattern from the other video nah that was too much that took that hair took at least three hours for me to take out i had to comb out all the individual braids all right in the front then this was going one way then i had the back and uh, i'm not doing all that i don't plan on doing nothing to this hair but leaving it out or just pinning it back like that so i did straight cornrows going back but i will do this little weird front piece on camera in the bathroom and i'll do the rest in the living room so let me get my crochet needle one second okay got my needle uh this is how they they're, they're still long to me some people like their hair very long i don't got time for that i'm so disappointed i'm so disappointed i tried to put a little edge control but my hair is just i don't know but which, which way is the end and oh this is i think this is the loop i think this is the loop the loop the loop I don't know how this is gonna look because this it ruined it just ruined Ugh. all right so we're just gonna do like we normally do and um everybody said just push it up and there we go there's one <laughs> i was really skeptical about uh buying this i wasn't sure how it was gonna look on me i didn't want to look like a mop or anything but a lot of people's passion twists I saw on Amazon um, in the pictures were really nice I was like all right maybe I might look nice with it I don't know we'll see so I was indecisive about buying this at first I was really in the funk I actually had another hair 
I was gonna buy. Well, actually, I did buy it. What am I talking about? <laughs> I mean, actually, I, I was meant another hair I was gonna install. Gosh, Michelle, you're such a diss. And I started twisting it, and I was just like, I'm tired of color of this color, and I'm tired of this um same dry hair. I'm just, I love kinky twist hair, but it's dry as heck. So I was just like, I'm not in the mood for. Ugh, just wasn't in the mood for all that. So in the middle of twisting it, I just said, I can't. I'm just going to do something different. I honestly wasn't trying to try a new hairstyle right now. I just wanted something done to my hair. I didn't want to wear my real hair at because that means I have to get a relaxer because my hair needs to be touched up like nobody's business. Ugh, come on. Get in there. Ouch. It's not bad. I just wish I had color. I really wanted some red at the ends or uh, something, but they didn't have much. They had colors, but they had more solid colors like this, like 1B or 4 and 2. I'm like, and then they, of course they had the 1B27, which is the color I just took out, but I'm tired of that color. So I just went with 950, I guess. Not enough red in it for me, but whatever. I could have ordered it from Amazon because online they had a lot of nice color choices, but uh, I kind of needed the hair like now. Honestly, it feels so good to take a break from doing my own hair. I'm always doing my own hair, meaning like, well, I'm always doing my own hair in general. Like, I haven't been to a hair salon in years. Um, for braided style, not not my real hair. When I get it cut and permed, that's different. Pfft, I ain't messing with that. Sometimes it's nice to take a break, even though I'm still doing my own hair. I don't have to twist this, and it's like, <sighs> Michelle, why don't you take a break sometimes and let yourself buy pre-twisted hair? Cause this is pretty. <laughs> it needs a little shine, so I'm definitely gonna have to spray some sheen on it later on, uh, so it can give it a little pop of. So this is one, one pack. Oh, that's not good for me. <laughs> that is what I'm talking about. This is one pack of hair. And the second one should be the rest of this. Then I got, so I already used like almost one pack trying to corn roll my hair and I had to cut it. So that, that hair that I started to use this is done. They did say six packs is good, like for a full head, so I am hoping this is enough. So let me go get the other pack and hope this is enough. <laughs> I hope so. I am so scared right now. How is everybody doing? Everything is kind of opened up. Phase three, phase two, I don't know. All I can say is just be careful. A lot of people are rushing to restaurants and stuff, especially where I live. Everybody's rushing to restaurants and bars and ugh. I'm like, dang, that y'all were really suffering out there. You just couldn't survive without the bars and stuff. Guess a lot of people use drinking to cope with certain things, but just be careful because a lot of these people over here are not wearing their mask. I get it if you're about to eat, but no, they're sitting in large groups not wearing their masks. I'm like you really think that's a good idea? Me, I'm not in a rush to go anywhere. I'm just thankful that their businesses are open. Because, you know, people got to make a living. They got to live, you know, pay for their rent and stuff. So I am happy about that. I'm just like, y'all act like we didn't just have a pandemic that took so many people out of here. I love how bouncy this is. It's so, it is, it really is lightweight. It really is lightweight. It's just, I can't get over the color. If anything, if it bothers me that bad, I'm gonna probably go back to the hair store and maybe find red and mix it in. Take some of these brown, you know, take some of these colors out and mix some color in it because it's just a little too one. Yeah, if I wanted one color, I would just got black. But they didn't, like I said, they didn't have any choices, no color choices. Mm, okay. Not sure about this. Uh, I mean, on other people, it looks nice. <laughs> Why not on me? What did I ever do to you? <sighs> we shall see what the rest of this is going to look like. Because honestly, I can't tell from this. Uh, 
standpoint. <laughs> Yeah, it looks so bald. But I'll be back when I finish putting it in the rest of my hair. And y'all could be the judge. I mean, I mean, it looks okay. But I just got to get used to this. I never wore it. I mean, I see it. I see it. Like, I see it. Like, you know, you know what I'm saying? I see it. Like, I don't know. But I'll see you guys when I finish doing my hair. And y'all can let me know. Hey, hi guys, it is the next day and um, I just got home from work so don't mind, I can't even see my girlfriend anyway. But this is what I ended up, how I ended up wearing my hair. It's finished, It's I'm starting to like it, I'm starting to like it. It's starting to grow on me. Um, so what I, I did end up fixing my hair, it wasn't as hard as I thought. I found the piece of hair in the back, I cut the thread and then slowly started pulling it slowly, combing it out and what I did was, as you can see, let me take the bobby pins down, hold on. Okay, so this is what it looks like down, it looks the same. So as you can see now I have a longer part because I took the extension and um, sewed it, I mean crocheted, I took the crochet needle and um, crocheted the hair within this cornrow. So, some of these I put the, the thing on so you can't see but you can see how I tried even though they're like not lined up perfectly yeah so now I have a deeper part which I'm much happier about um but it's not enough hair it's not enough hair and I don't know if I mentioned this in the first part of the video but I used uh, salt and pepper braid in here I believe I said that and you can kind of see some of the salt and pepper in my braids. I don't know if you can see that, like right here. It's like, hmm, if I wear my hair down, you can kind of see the salt and pepper. So I went to the store and I did find red. I was like, yes! I went, I went to the store and I got, this one is, I don't know what it's called, it's 2T1, oh, 2T1B slash 425. I don't know. It just looks like a 99J ombre. I don't know. I wanted to add some color because this has color, but it's not quite enough. I think it's nice. I'm not gonna lie, it's starting to grow on me, especially wearing a little lipstick. Fortunately, you can't wear it at work because I gotta wear a mask at work all day. I'm tired of wearing a mask at work. But I work in a hospital, what can I do? I don't know, it is starting to grow on me a little bit. Maybe the fuller it gets, you can't, it looks black right here, but it's not really. It has some color in it. So I wanted to add some pops of color, especially in the area. Look at this, ain't got no hair there. <laughs> Took away to put in some other areas. Yeah, see a little color that would make it look a little, I don't want it stripy or anything, but. I do want to add pops of color to this because it just has nothing going on. So I'm going through each row and adding it sparingly. Um, the problem is I only brought two packs but I'm still on the first pack. I'm still on the first pack and I'm like in the middle of my head which is good. Yeah, it's definitely missing hair. <laughs> I ran out of hair so it's like what do you want me to do? Okay, it's starting to get super full right now. So I'm I don't want to put so much hair because mm. I feel not you know a little bit less hair makes it look a little bit more natural even though everybody know this ain't my hair everybody at my job know that ain't your hair shell that ain't your hair so anyway guys there you have it I used the whole two packs whatever was left and put this red color to give it some sort of pop I mean I was kind of expecting a different type of hair um, from the bomb twist or passion twist. I think maybe it's passion twist I really wanted. I wanted it not as bulky and um, the ends to be a little bit, you know, more curlier. Not, I don't know. It's just a little too bulky for me. You know, I'm just gonna have to grow to love it. But don't I look like um Chantel? Y'all know who Chantel is. Like, <laughs> why? Uh, uh, uh. My hair is stuck in my bra. <laughs> Y'all know what I'm talking about, like Chantel. Uh -huh. <laughs> like, I don't know what kind of hair she had in her head in the early 90s, but it was just like mad. 
I wouldn't say this is my favorite hairstyle, but you can't always do it perfectly. Um, every hairstyle is not going to be your favorite. <laughs> I don't know. I just wanted to try this, the bomb twist. I don't know. Uh, I'm tired. I'm sweaty. I'm hot. I just came home from work. I need to take a shower. Yeah, so this is it, guys. So I'm going to go ahead and take a shower. But if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button down below. And also, please, if you're not subscribed and you want to see more of my weird content, please, don't forget to hit the, please hit the subscribe button down below. Y'all know y'all want to. Y'all know you want to see more of this, um, you know, bomb twist. I have no idea and I already put um, oil sheen and all that spray and stuff um, yesterday in the, pre in the earlier video yeah I already did all that so I'm not gonna do that I'm tired I want to take a shower and I want to eat and be fat right now <laughs> anyway I'll see you guys in my next hair video thank you so much for watching peace no piece of a town down this time from New York baby Brooklyn be who was that I'm not from Brooklyn either. I, let me stop. <laughs>